According to 7, whether you're taking the kids out to the park or the beach this summer, you want to make sure their skin is protected from the sun. Yeah, and there's a right and wrong way to use sunscreen on the kiddos. Haley Hernandez is here with some good stuff this morning we yeah, need to know. Yeah, lots of questions about yeah. sunscreen, right? Can you buy any brand or do kids need special ingredients? Which is better, the sunblock or the spray? One pediatric dermatologist says the right answer is whatever you can get them to wear. Simon says. Texas Children's and Baylor College of Medicine fellow Dr. Spot. Shannon McCann teaches patients like Emma that applying sunscreen can be fun by making it a game. Simon says. <laughs> Apply it to your right hand. Emma takes the bait and does a good job globbing it on where Simon says. And this is the perfect amount. It looks like too much, but Dr. McCann says a golf ball size or a shot glass full is the recommended amount. On average, the majority of people only apply 25 to 50% of the needed amount of sunscreen. Reapply every two hours with an SPF of 30, broad spectrum coverage, and water resistant at least 15 to 30 minutes before going in the sun paying close attention to spots frequently missed like the ears hands and feet and she says in order to protect that part line on sensitive scalps wear a hat Sunscreens in aerosol cans typically get less approval than creams, but Dr. McCann says it's better to have kids use this than fight about it. Apply these indoors since outside tends to blow the mist away. Don't inhale the fumes, spray a thick layer, and the key is to rub it in. Because that can help improve making sure you get good coverage all over. And although experts say to keep exposure to a minimum for babies under six months, brands marketed towards babies babies contain hypoallergenic components that she says are preferred when very young children are in the sun. The brand, she says, yeah. is a little preferred for those really young ones. Yeah. Uh -huh. Now, sunscreen does expire every three years. It's time for a new bottle. But Dr. McCann <laughs> says you should be going through at least an entire bottle in one summer, probably more. That seems like a lot. But if you know that I used this one last summer, but I can't remember if I used it the summer before that or the one before that. So definitely time to toss it. Yeah, yeah they put the expiration dates really fine and hard to find. It's hard to find. Which Sometimes it wears off because you throw it in your beach bag. Sure. So if you can't remember when we bought it, probably just buy a new bottle this summer. Right, good point. I like the idea about the games. It seems to, you know, the games gets help. So the doctor excited. says always make sure that you're wearing it. Set mm -hmm. the example. And another game suggestion she has is to race. Get a timer and find <laughs> out who can do it the fastest. And then, of course, make sure that parents double check. Um, also use a paintbrush. She yeah. said have the kids paint it on each oh, that's other. Good. That yeah. may work. If, if all else fails, is that we're not even going to the pool without your sunscreen. So. Yep. Oh yeah, then you gotta you know, draw a hard line there. But she said, you know, you know, try to make it fun so that yeah, they don't no, associate course. it with anything negative. Well, my boys are super competitive, so anything that's a race. You put a game a or a race. <laughs> or everything's a race in our house. Who can paint it on each other the fastest? Yep, who can beat you and yeah, but there's no winners. There's literally no winners. Mom <laughs> <laughs> <Long> loses every time. <laughs> I'm the loser. There are no winners. Yep. I'm sure every parent has their own tricks of the trade that work for them. Gotta find them, man. You gotta find them. You know what I find? I put sunscreen on before I go running and then I start to sweat and the sunscreen gets oh, in my that. eyes. Oh. And it's that's the worst. Yeah, well, you gotta bring the sweatband back. Oh, yeah, oh, baby. Nice. Haley has talking. got an answer for everything. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> I was just waiting for my chance to bring up the sweatband. <laughs> Been waiting to beat. And fashionable. <laughs> you just cannot catch her on an off moment. <laughs>